now in this video we discuss about male pattern hair loss or male pattern baldness male pattern hair loss or male pattern baldness is estimated to affect about 50 million men in the united states male pattern hair loss or male pattern baldness start with hair loss above the temple generating the typical m shape hair loss continuous around the top of the head and sometimes clumps their hair on the sides and rear of the head as well leading to complete baldness if you are suffering from male pattern baldness or male pattern hair loss then see this video to solve the solution from male pattern baldness or male pattern hair loss in this video we say how to treat male pattern hair loss in this video we discuss three method to solve male pattern hair loss or male pattern baldness method 1 exploring treatment options step 1 Understand how male pattern baldness works. Although androgenic alopecia is linked with the presence of male sex hormones, androgens, its exact cause is unknown. Male pattern baldness is caused by genetic predisposition and the main androgen believed to be associated with baldness is dihydrotestosterone (DHT). Increased level of DHT in hair follicles is believed to shorten the hair's growth cycle and delay growth of new hair. Sometime the hair follicles stop growing new hair. However, the follicles remain alive, suggesting that they may still be able to grow new hair. Step 2. Try minoxidil, Rogaine. Minoxidil is an FDA approved topical treatment to treat male pattern baldness. It is a solution that stimulates the hair follicles to grow and is applied directly onto your scalp. Minoxidil slows hair loss and some men experience growth of new hair. However, Hair loss usually returns if the medication is stopped, so you must continue using minoxidil to continue to see results. Step 3. Ask your doctor if you should take finasteride. Finasteride slows hair loss as long as you take it. However, as soon as you discontinue therapy, hair loss typically returns within a year. Side effects associated with finasteride include chills, cold sweats, confusion, dizziness, hives, swelling in the legs, arms and face, tingling. erectile dysfunction decreased libido and ejaculatory dysfunction and weight gain step 4 get a hair transplant during a hair transplant tiny patches of hair are moved from one part of your scalp to the balding area hair transplants are usually done during several sessions and although they can be expensive the results are effective and permanent method 2 improving your hair health step 1 Eat hairless fighting power foods. Nutritional imbalances are often the cause for hair loss. Poor diet can lead to macronutrient, proteins, fats, carbohydrates, and micronutrient, vitamins and minerals deficiencies which in turn can make your body unhealthy and cause hair loss. Eat red, yellow and orange fruits and vegetables that are packed with vitamin A or beta carotene. Some research suggests that vitamin A promotes the growth and health of cells. including hair follicles promote healthy hair by eating fatty fish such as salmon and sardines that are packed with omega-3 fatty acids eat yogurt and other vitamin b5 rich foods that may increase blood flow to your scalp and consequently promote hair growth eat foods that contain vitamin b7 which may help promote hair growth foods to eat include eggs fortified cereals milk products and chicken eat synchric foods such as oysters lobster and fortified cereals zinc deficiency can cause hair loss which is why you should ensure you are getting enough of this mineral from your daily diet step 2 drink lots of water if your body isn't hydrated your skin and hair cells won't be able to grow and flourish to keep your hair healthy and growing drink plenty of water to prevent dehydration step 3 eliminate stress in your life Although androgenic alopecia is not reported to be stress related, stress can cause hair loss. In order to keep your hair healthy, avoid factors that trigger stress in your life. Telogen effluvium is a condition in which stress forces a large number of hair follicles to go into a resting phase and fall out within months. Alopecia areata is a condition caused by the body's immune system attacking hair follicles, which results in hair loss. Unlike male pattern baldness, Stress-induced hair loss is not necessarily permanent. If you control the stress, your hair might grow back. Step 4. Get a physical exam. Some health conditions and diseases can cause hair loss that is not related to male pattern, baldness. 
If you are losing hair, visit your doctor who can diagnose the cause of hair loss, hormonal imbalances and changes, such as during pregnancy, after childbirth or during menopause for women, and thyroid conditions can cause temporary hair loss. Scalp infections, such as those caused by ringworm, can invade the hair and cause scaly patches and hair loss. Hair generally grows back when the infection is treated. Method 3. Using Natural Remedies Step 1. Try Onion Juice Although more scientific studies are needed, onion juice may promote hair growth in patients who suffer from alopecia areata. According to a small study of 23 participants, applying crude onion juice to the scalp twice a day promoted hair regrowth within 6 weeks, in 20 participants. Step 2. Try Scalp Massage Massaging your scalp will increase blood flow to the hair follicles, which can promote scalp health and strengthen your hair's roots. However, his method has not been scientifically proven to reduce or prevent hair loss and you should, try it with that in mind, use coconut or almond hair oil, or other oils such as olive, castor, or amala, Indian gooseberry, oil. Optionally, you can add a few drops of rosemary oil or lavender oil to make a mixture. Step 3. Try fenugreek seed paste. Fenugreek, methi, seeds contain ingredients that may stimulate hair growth and enhance rebuilding of hair follicles. Mix one cup of fenugreek seeds in water. Let it soak overnight. Grind the mixture and make a paste that you then can apply to your hair. Cover with a plastic bag or shower cap and let it sit for about 40 minutes. Rinse your hair and repeat every morning for a month. Step 4. Try other home remedies. Try aloe vera gel, which may help optimize your scalp's pH and promote healthy hair growth. Massage aloe vera gel to the scalp and leave it on for an hour. Wash off and repeat 3 to 4 times a week. Try licorice root paste, which has properties that may help soothe the scalp and help reduce irritation. Mix ground licorice root, 1 tablespoon, saffron, quarter teaspoon, and a cup of milk. Apply the mixture on bald areas, cover and leave it on overnight. Rinse off in the morning and repeat once or twice a week. Try Chinese hibiscus flower that may help promote hair growth, cure dandruff, and thicken hair. Mix flowers with coconut oil. Heat until charred and strain to collect the oil. Apply to the scalp at bedtime and leave it on for overnight. In the morning, wash your hair and repeat a few times a week. 